This is the face of autism, a developmental and neurobiological disorder that impairs ability to process and integrate ordinary information. As a result, they have problems in speech, language, and communication. Some basic symptoms of autism include a hard time adapting to new environments, inability to communicate desires and wants, limited eye contact, and repetitive behaviors. Although there is no cure for this disorder, technology brings hope to their future. For the 60% of these children that are unable to communicate their wants, needs, and thoughts verbally, there is what's called Augmentative and Alternative Communication, also known as AAC. Since the majority of children with autism don't make eye contact or socialize, they cannot learn as easily by body language, facial cues, and hand gestures. But since the majority of children with autism are visual learners who think in pictures, they need these visual cues. This is why technology such as AAC is the best method for advancing communication in children with autism. This technology can look like an app on the iPad or other similar device that has tabs with pictures. Children can find the words they need under each tab. When they press a button, the word is said aloud. This auditory aspect can also be helpful in verbal language comprehension, which could possibly teach them how to verbally communicate. According to data from ASHA's National Outcomes Measurement System, two-thirds of preschoolers with autism showed gains of one or more levels following speech-language pathology intervention with use of AACs. Similar gains were also seen in two other frequently treated areas, spoken language comprehension and pragmatics, with 72% and 63% of children achieving one or more levels on a scale of 1 to 7 of progress, respectively. As you can see, technology has greatly advanced and improved the lives of children with autism already. I know the future can only get brighter.